Addressing journalists in Abuja, Nogusa President called on the Nigerian Port Authority, NPA, and the Nigerian Maritime Administration and Safety Agency, NIMASA, to stop all payments on petroleum products in dollar in order to ease transportation of petroleum products. Okori noted that considering the problems associated with the removal of fuel subsidy, it has become imperative for government to do all within its power to alleviate the suffering of oil and gas suppliers, adding that there is need to address the country's exchange rate crisis as it is making it difficult to import petroleum products. Removing of subsidy, we support the removal of subsidy last year when Mr. President removed the subsidy. We supported it. To today we supported it. But the system is not working, working well. Anytime dollar increases, the diesel increases that amount, which is wrong. We are facing two. Because there's no reason for you to be trading on dollar in the first instance. You don't need dollar. You need Naira. Naira is strong. It's a big country, strong country. He further called on the federal government to declare a state of emergency on refinery, saying there is need to tackle unending delay in their takeoff, urging the government to fix a price for the dollar regardless of the inflow. The problem that is holding most of these refineries, modular refineries, to come up full capacity is this exchange rate. So the answer to it is that the government should come out and tell Nigerians this is how much dollar is. Not this window, or whatever they call it on the radio, on the TV, window, uh, forest, or whatever. Let Nigeria, let the government come out and say, 500 naira to a dollar, or 200 naira to a dollar, whatever rate that they come out with, they should stand. Whether the price, whether the black market is going 1 billion naira, it should not bother Nigeria. Let them come and fix one, then peg it 750 naira as they, as, as they said in their budget, so that work with 750. And then the crude oil that will be sold to Nigerians, I mean the Nigerian refineries, modular refineries, will be sold at 750 naira per dollar, convert it, and they will pay in dollar. I will pay in naira, sorry. The association further appealed to the government to intervene in fixing the deplorable condition of roads in the country following the flooding that has affected some section of the road. Is that we concentrate on road to reduce the rate that we maintain our trucks, vehicles in Nigeria. You are talking about the dollar. You will agree with me that 70% of our dollars go to spare parts. And these spare parts are vehicle spare parts. And it's dollar that is going. You are now asking, where is this dollar going? Where is this? No, it's not, it's not oil. If you fix the road, and the road is good, vehicle will spend like 10 years, no spare parts. Nogosa, however, urged the federal government to reintroduce and strengthen petroleum equalization fund to enable marketers recoup and reinvest their funds for the benefits of the industry and the economy. Kikelomo Okewe, Global Television News.